let's build this hutch cabinet for way less. To keep it looking as close to the original as possible, I made grooves in the wood with my router, which allowed me to glue up the cabinet box without having any visible fasteners. To build the doors, I made a groove in the longer side pieces and a tenon in the shorter ones, which slides right into the groove, also known as mortise and tenon. It fits together like a puzzle. To finish off the doors, I routed a groove in the back for the glass to rest in and then used these overlay hinges to attach them to the cabinet. To get it as close as possible to the original, I tapered the legs and glued up the base and made the two bottom drawers by making more grooves in the wood and added soft closed drawer slides. I rounded over both sides to give a softer look and I bought a sheet of acrylic for $65 and cut it with my oscillating saw. To get rid of that red in the oak, I used Boardwalk by Real Milk paint for a tan wash and then used their chestnut brown wax to give it this beautiful aged oak look. Then I installed the glass with these glass clips and here is how it turned out. I built mine for about $400, which is a lot less than the original. Let me know what you think in the comments.